<laughs> oh, so good, so good. I tell you what, guys. Uh, all three of the chaps with me today are doing a fantastic job on those big heavy bikes, the two BMWs and the Beast Drum, picking their way through these uh, boulder fields. I had us off here, gentlemen. A oh, nice little water crossing. Top box is open. Oh, fuck. Thank you. All good. Oh, 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 that's down. Well, guys, it's at this point that we uh, meet Highway 1 by the looks of it, and we will be losing a rider here. Alright guys, so we've uh, said farewell to Adam, he's headed right and gone back towards Hobart but we will be turning left to head towards Ross. Now you guys would have seen uh, Ross in my Three Villages episode and uh, we were originally going to stop there for fuel but the bikes are doing really well so the plan now is to continue to push through to Lake Lee and that's where we'll end today's episode. So guys, we're on the Midland Highway now. It's not going to be particularly interesting, so I might uh, shut the cameras down and uh, we'll come to you from Ross. See you shortly. Alright guys, here we are in Ross again. And we are just about to cross the Ross Bridge. It's actually the third oldest continuously used bridge in Australia, I believe. And where we started the Three Villages episode. Now we're just skirting Ross today, we're not actually going to be entering the village which would be the left turn up ahead. We're going to pick up the same road that I took on uh, the previous episode. No traffic, excellent. Um, and follow that through for quite a way until we find the turn off for Honeysuckle Road. So if you remember I found my way out to Tombs Lake and uh, really enjoyed it. We'll be taking the same road, but not all the way in. So guys, I'm going to uh, flick the visor down and uh, push through. Alright guys, so this is where it deviates from uh, the three villages ride. This is Honeysuckle. And it's loose.
Well, that was close. Oh, Skippy wanted to come and have a bit of a look at the bikes. But, uh, not what you want at all. Quite no surprised we're out this early in the day. Guys, I don't know if you can see me, that front camera is wobbling around a heck of a lot, but crikey! There are a lot of, uh, a lot of wallabies around in this section, and a lot <laughs> of really stony, shitty, oh, bumpy, washouty sections. Oh. Wow! That, uh, that was a bit of work, that little downhill section. Looks like it might be continuing. Far out, isn't there? Right. This is a very rutted, washed out section. Lots of big rocks. Wow, that, way, yeah. that was something. What'd you think of that? I wish I had a 21 inch front. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe slack a bit of air out of the tires. Oh man, it's not too bad, it's not deflecting or anything, it's just I'm stressing about wrecking the tire. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah that's what I'm worried about. Yeah. It's, it's, um, it's not as gnarly from here on. Yep. No, oh, not, it was fun. It's nothing like that. Yeah, there good. Might be a couple of spots that out, but nothing really bad. Yeah, definitely good fun. But yeah, yeah. used to riding with a 21, and yeah. I'm very mindful that uh, that's a 19. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. So, oh well, shall we uh, go through a little water splash? There's your creek crossing. <laughs> Better turn it back on. Down to one bar. Yep. 4.30, you're doing good. Guys, a little bit of water. I say a little bit, she is quite deep by the looks of it. Not too bad. Oh. 
All good? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 Those windscreen wipers on. <laughs> 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 oh, fantastic. Uh, well, I think that's a... <laughs> Oh, uh, so good. Yeah. Oh, dear. I think that one caught Tim out a little bit. Excellent. Guys, that kind of came out of nowhere, but um, <laughs> we're back on the tarmac, heading towards Lake Lee.
Kalangado store. And fuel. And there we have it guys, another fantastic day of riding on the by roads, but this is where we're going to pause things at the uh, Kalangadu store. Probably said that wrong, correct me in the comments if you uh, know how to say it properly. But uh, a massive shout out to everyone that came along, Tanya for coming on the first leg and um, bouncing off at the power station, Adam uh, departing just before Ross, and we've got uh, Tim and Daryl that have come all the way through, so thanks guys. But that's going to do it for this one. Uh, we will be jumping back on the bikes very shortly and uh, we'll be picking up the, the by roads to continue on, uh, hopefully in the next episode. As always guys, we thank you for following along and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.